Good afternoon, guys. Um, so we're looking at protest number 25 here in the GT4 series. That was in the race session. We're on lap 22, so about three quarters in the race. <clears throat> we have a battle here for P3. So we're going to take a look at the incidents and make sure that all the angles, angles are covered for the stewards to make a decision. We are at Barber Motorsport. All right, that's a matter of uh, corner rights, I believe. So what we are looking for here is, is there any um, illegal actions taken by the car in front? So changing lines, for example. Was there enough uh, space left? Was this a dive bomb? Was there contact? Those are the elements that we are looking for. We're also looking for uh, sportsmanship. Uh, you know, when you're making a move and that you feel that it wasn't uh, fully clean, then you might give back the position, for example. That could have been uh, interesting. All right, so and for turning in, the PRL rules are that when uh, you have the turn in, um, so at the turn in, we are expecting the front car to leave enough space if um, <clears throat> if there is sufficient overlap, and sufficient overlap is defined in PRL by uh, the car at the back having his front tires leveled with rear tires of the car in front. I'm not sure we have that here. The white car was definitely defending. There was definitely a contact, I would say. So let's take a look from uh, the cockpit view. From the car in the back. Right. And from the current front perspective, all right. I think I have pretty much what I need. Have a day, nice stay, guys.